Hello guys, welcome to the English Easier with Eric. In this video, you will listen to some daily English conversations in different situations and places. Definitely, you will learn useful vocabulary, phrases and improve your English speaking and listening skills. Let's take a look. Billing or payment issues. Hi, I'm making a complaint about my billing statement. I'm sorry to hear that. Can you tell me what the issue is? Yes, I was billed twice for the same service. I received my statement yesterday, and it shows that I was charged twice for the same amount. I apologize for the error. Let me take a look at your account and see what happened. Okay, thank you. I can see that there was an error in our system that caused the double billing. I will issue a refund for the duplicate charge and make sure that it doesn't happen again in the future. Okay, that's good to hear. I also wanted to mention that I've had some issues with your payment system. When I tried to make a payment online, the system kept giving me an error message and wouldn't let me complete the transaction. I'm sorry to hear that. Our payment system has been experiencing some technical difficulties recently. We are working to resolve the issue as soon as possible. In the meantime, you can make a payment over the phone or through the mail. Okay, thanks for letting me know. I just wanted to make sure that these issues are addressed so that I don't have any more problems in the future. I understand. We appreciate your feedback and apologize for any inconvenience caused. Please let us know if there's anything else we can do to assist you. Product or service issues. Hi, I'm calling to make a complaint about a product I received from your company. I'm sorry to hear that. Can you tell me what the issue is? Yes, I ordered a laptop from your website, but when it arrived, it was damaged. The screen was cracked, and it wouldn't turn on. I'm sorry to hear that. That's certainly not the level of quality we aim to provide. Can you provide me with your order number so I can investigate the matter further? Sure. My order number is 123456. Thank you. I can see that your order was shipped out last week. I will make sure to follow up with our shipping department to find out what happened and arrange for a replacement to be sent out to you. Okay, that would be great. I also wanted to let you know that I had some issues with your customer service when I tried to report the issue. The representative I spoke with was not very helpful and seemed annoyed when I was trying to explain the situation. I'm sorry to hear that. I will make sure to follow up with that representative and provide additional training if necessary. We want to make sure that all of our customers receive excellent service. Thank you. I appreciate your help in resolving this issue. No problem. We value your feedback and apologize for any inconvenience caused. Please let us know if there's anything else we can do to assist you. Poor customer service. <clears throat> Ice in my veins, I've been driving this train. Years. Hi, I wanted to make a complaint about the poor customer service I received at your store yesterday. I'm sorry to hear that. Can you tell me what happened? Sure. When I walked into the store, I was ignored by the staff, who were chatting with each other. When I asked for assistance, they seemed annoyed and didn't seem interested in helping me. Then when I was checking out, the cashier was rude and seemed impatient when I was trying to use a coupon. I apologize for the poor service you received. That's not the level of service we aim to provide our customers. Can you provide me with some more details so that I can investigate the matter further? Yes. I have the names of the staff members who were involved, as well as the time and date of the incident. I also have a copy of the coupon that the cashier wouldn't accept. Thank you for providing that information. I will make sure to follow up with the staff members involved and take appropriate action. 
Is there anything else I can do to help resolve the issue? No, that's all for now. I just wanted to make sure that this doesn't happen again in the future. I understand. Thank you for bringing this to our attention. We value your feedback and will work to improve our customer service going forward. Safety concerns. In my veins, I've been driving this train years in this I'm sorry to hear that. Can you tell me what the issue is? Yes, I was at your restaurant yesterday, and I noticed that there were several chairs that were broken and could potentially cause someone to fall and injure themselves. I apologize for the safety hazard. Thank you for bringing this to our attention. We take safety very seriously and will make sure to have the chairs fixed immediately. Can you tell me which area of the restaurant the chairs were in? Yes, they were in the corner near the windows. Okay, I will make sure to have someone go and inspect the chairs in that area and make the necessary repairs. Thank you. I also wanted to mention that I noticed there were some slippery areas on the floor that could also cause someone to fall. I think it might be a safety hazard that needs to be addressed. Thank you for letting us know. We will make sure to inspect the area and take the necessary steps to ensure the safety of our customers. If there's anything else you notice that concerns you, please don't hesitate to let us know. Okay, thank you for your help in addressing these safety concerns. I appreciate it. No problem. We value your feedback and take safety very seriously. Please let us know if there's anything else we can do to assist you. Smart ways to improve your speaking skills. Greatest. Everybody on the face shit. I look around and feel like everybody is the fakest. I make this every day and I'm impatient. Hoping one day I blow up from the basement. Statement. The top is so vacant. I don't need shit that I think is amazing. Waiting for my day when I'm playing. Sold out shows for a thousand faces. Hey, give me that crown. Get in my way and you'll be put down. It ain't your place. I'll diss my town. If I want that shit, then I'll get it right now. I'm losing it. The noose fits. The moose shit. The stupid myth. You choose to live or choose to dip. You choose to fight. And that's it for today's English lesson. I hope you found this video helpful and informative. If you enjoyed this lesson, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more English language learning videos. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them down below and we'll do our best to respond. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of our future English lessons. And if you want to take your English learning to the next level, check out our channel more often. Thanks again for watching and we'll see you in the next English lesson.